wondering about Wispu Sink and what it does for your Kindle, stick around till the end to know all there is to know about Wispu Sync for your Kindle devices and how you can enable or disable them. Wispu Sync is Amazon's version of a universal sync protocol that takes note of your reading history, your saved annotations, and the highlights from your books and allows you to transition between your various Kindle devices and services. With the new Whisper Sync for Voice feature, it's also possible to sync your progress between an ebook and a compatible audiobook between various devices. To illustrate this in layman terms, consider the following. You have a book downloaded and synced onto your Kindle. After reading through a few pages, you decide to resume your reading session on another device, say a mobile phone via the Kindle app. Well, with WhisperSync enabled on your devices, all your progress along with your annotations, highlights and any other notes that you have made on your Kindle will be available on your phone readily. The only prerequisite is to have your Kindle and your other device connected to the internet at all times. You can also sync and resume your progress between ebooks and audiobooks with WhisperSync for voice, provided the title has both versions available and is compatible directly via the Kindle store. The sync is universal, meaning any progress on any device connected to your Amazon account will be synced across all devices in your account. And that's pretty much it with WhisperSync. And let's now take a look at how to enable or disable it. WhisperSync usually comes enabled once you've set up your Kindle devices. All you need is a stable internet connection to get it to work. But if WhisperSync is not enabled on your Kindle device, or if you have issues with WhisperSync, you can easily enable or refresh it from the settings menu. To access the WhisperSync settings on your Kindle, open the Quick Actions tab and select All Settings. Navigate to Device Options and select Advanced Settings. Now, enable the WhisperSync for Books feature and you're good to go. Once you've changed the status of your WhisperSync setting, I recommend that you perform a system reboot on your device just to refresh the device. All you need to do is press and hold the power button for about 40 seconds until the dialog box appears on screen. Select Restart to initiate the reboot. Now, suppose you have multiple devices that has access to your Kindle and Amazon account. In that case, you can easily enable WhisperSync for all your devices rather than individually setting it up for each device. To do so, hop onto your Amazon account using a PC and navigate to the Manage Your Contents in Devices tab, which I'll link in the description below. Now, tap the Preferences style and select Device Synchronization of WhisperSync settings. You can now toggle on or off WhisperSync for all your devices. And with that, I believe that I've touched on everything that I wanted to talk about regarding WhisperSync for Kindle devices. It is a very simple feature that accomplishes a lot considering the convenience that it provides. If you found this video useful, do comment your thoughts below, give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more Kindle content like this.